Hi, my name is Andrea, and welcome to my kitchen. Today, we're going to talk about a special ingredient that can take your food up to the next level. And it's something you probably already have in your kitchen. That's right, it's wine. And I use it just about every day. So we're going to go ahead and make a basic wine marinade. We're going to start with 3 fourths cup of your favorite red wine. Chopped garlic, some salt, a little parsley, and a little oregano. And of course, about two tablespoons of olive oil. I'm gonna go ahead and whisk all of these together, put it in a Ziploc bag with my meat, seal it, and let it marinate for at least two to four hours. And cook as desired. Another popular way to use wine is to make a sauce with it. Now the basis for any sauce is fat. And what I have in this pan is the drippings from the sausage that I just fried up. I'm also gonna add a little bit of olive oil to kind of coat the pan so there's no burning. The pan's hot, but not too hot. I'm gonna go ahead and add my wine. After the wine has reduced by about half, then I'm gonna go ahead and add my other liquid, being tomatoes and sauce. I'm also gonna add my salt, my oregano, my parsley. I'm also gonna add back the sausage that I had taken out. Simmer until thickened and serve with your favorite pasta. But why stop at dinner? Wine makes delicious desserts too. Merlot chocolate brownies, champagne cupcakes, or, for a super easy dessert, take your favorite fruit, pour in your favorite sparkling wine, throw in some mint leaves, give a good stir, and serve chilled. And while we all know that red wine goes best with red meat and white wine goes best with white meat, get creative. Use a fruity sangria as a marinade for a chicken. Either way, the possibilities with wine are endless. Cheers!